So today I'm back for some more Minecraft Skyblock and trust me, you guys are going to love this video. What is going on TFG squad? My name is Brandon and welcome back to Minecraft Skyblock. So I'm back to the server that I played last week. I made a sugarcane farm. So basically I can kind of cut all of the sugarcane down and then I can sell it for a lot of money, which is wonderful. Also, my little guy Jimmy over here, which is my robot, has been super busy Look at all the stone, lapis lazuli, and redstone he's gotten. So I do want to mention today's video is sponsored by Skyforge. Skyforge is a sci-fi action MMO. I love sci-fi, I love action, and I love playing MMOs. So this is kind of the perfect game for me. So you start the game by choosing between one of three classes, and you could eventually unlock up to 18 classes, all of which are immortal, and all of which possess incredible celestial powers. So the game is absolutely free to download, absolutely free to play, and it's actually now available on the Nintendo Switch. You don't even need a Nintendo Switch online subscription. The combat in this game is perfectly optimized for the Switch. Whether you're playing on the TV, tabletop, or handheld mode, you get the same incredible Incredible intergalactic adventure. So for a limited time, if you guys download the game and play through the tutorial, they're going to give you some awesome gifts. Actually, six awesome gifts to be exact. Trust me, guys, you will love this game as much as I do. And like I said, it's free, so you got nothing to lose. Check out the link in the description below to download the game. And special thanks to Skyforge for sponsoring today's video. Okay, I sold all the stone, all the lapis, all the redstone dust, and all the sugar cane. And now I'm up to $903,000. But if you guys remember, if I go slash IS upgrade and then I go here, I can upgrade my cobblestone generator. So eventually little Jimmy can be mining diamonds, which is actually kind of amazing. It's $3 million and I only have 900,000, but that's okay. I went to the shop and I bought these money pouches or something like that. So I'm going to spend these and basically it gives me like millions of dollars. So you can see the minimum I get is a million per block and the maximum I could get is 2 million. Okay, okay, okay. So I could get mob coins. Let's see what this does. Whoa! That's awesome! So I just got 1,800 mob coins. Let me do the money pouch. This is the one that I really care about. How much am I gonna get? I got 1,700,000. Oh my gosh, I already have 2.64 million. Okay, let me do one more money pouch. I love the money pouches. This is amazing. Now I should have over 3 million. I think I just got 1.6 million. Yes, so now I have 4 million coins, which means if I go slash IS upgrade again, I can upgrade my cobblestone generator. Boom! Did it work? Yes, now I have a level two generator, which means little Jimmy is mining more expensive materials. Let me try to upgrade it again. Okay, so I'm using all of these pouches, so I'm getting extra XP, I'm getting mob coins, and obviously money. So now I am at 6.5 million, and I have one more pa- Oh, wait. That's a block of ice, Brandon! I thought it was another pouch. Oh my goodness gracious, wait. Let me grab a bucket, because then that's gonna spill all over my island. That's embarrassing. I literally just thought a pouch was a Or I thought a block of ice was a I don't even know what I'm talking about. Let's put this- let's break this. Let's pick it up. And can I put it in there? There we go, beautiful. Okay, let's put my bucket away. I didn't know I got a pig spawner! Oh, that's actually fantastic. So I can make like a little pig pen and have unlimited money. That's, that's awesome. Cobblestone generator, bam. Okay, now I have a level three cobblestone generator, which once again means that little Jimmy is going to be getting more and more expensive materials. Okay, what I'm going to be doing now is making my pig pen. And I am not the greatest builder in Minecraft, so I'm really going to have to use my big brains here. I think this is how you make- yes, okay, so that is how I make a fence, and then I think the opposite is how I make a gate. Well, I guess I'm really only gonna- only, only gonna need one gate. I can't talk today. Oh, wait, that's a fence too. Wait, no, I made the gate. This is the fence. Okay, I'm gonna try to make some gates and some fences and make a pig pen. I should have enough. Now, where do I want to put my pigs? I'm gonna put them right next to my cactus farm because- I don't know, why not? So let's do a, a fence here, a fence here, a fence here. Uh, that should be big enough. Oh my gosh, the darn flower got in my way. And there, okay. This seems like a nice pig pen and I think my fence is right here. Beautiful, okay. So let me take out, wait, where, do I have the pig spawner? Was the pig spawner in here? Everybody cover your eyes, there is a large chest on screen. There it is. Okay, so I assume if I put the pig spawner down, it will spawn pigs. 
because it's called a pig spawner, right? That would that would kind of make sense. Okay, so let's put that down. There they go. Oh, it's like a little tiny baby pig. Whoa, okay, that's not a baby pig. That is not a baby pig. So let me close the gate because I definitely don't want them ex escaping. There we go. Um, I'm sorry, beautiful pig, but if I... Oh, uh, oh no, he got out. Wait a second. That defeated the purpose of my pig pen. Hey, hey, get back here, you son of a nutcracker. Uh, I'm going to name you Elmer, even though Elmer's probably more of a cow's name. Come on. I got, I got food. So basically now I have unlimited food. Oh, and it looks like whenever I kill a pig, I get mob coins too. Okay, that's actually kind of cool. Let's see how little Jimmy's doing. Is he getting more redstone and lapis? He is. Okay, beautiful. That's really good. Oh, I also got these 11 potatoes in the shop. And you guys know I love baked potatoes in Minecraft. So I'm going to make a little potato farm. So let me grab my bucket of water. I'm going to make the potato farm. And then we're going to start building the tree fort. So I got my water there. I got my wooden hoe here. So let's do that. Let's do that. And then let's plant. Let's go six potatoes. Okay. That's a that's a nice little farm. You know what? Let's go eight. So let's do uh, that and that and then that and then that. Look at that. The frustrated gamer has a potato farm, which means unlimited baked potatoes, which I love. And I officially... Whoa, what is up with the baked potatoes? Okay, well, they work the same. I've got myself three baked potatoes, and I'm actually really hungry right now. If you listen in this server, after I'm done eating, my guy burps. Just listen really carefully. Did you hear? It was really quick, but I thought that was actually kind of cool. Okay, so I have a little bit of baked potatoes left and a couple uh, baked pork chops. Let's put this away. Let's start making our base. So I am going to use the axe to chop down some wood. I want to make my tree fort out of wood and... I guess cobblestone, although I feel like wood is the best material for a tree fort. So you know what? I'm going to make it all out of wood. Let me chop down some trees. Get out of my way, trees. I am going to chop you down and make the greatest tree fort ever. It's kind of ironic that I have to kill trees to make a tree fort. It, it seems kind of backwards. Okay, I think I have plenty of logs and then I could turn them into planks. Wait, why do my pigs keep getting out of the pig pen? Oh, wait, he's not getting out of the pig pen. He's just floating over the pig pen. Maybe I should have made the pig thing bigger. Oh, now this is two times the pig? Wait, so if I kill this dude, do I get extra pork chops? I do. Oh, that's cool. Now for the moment you've all been waiting for. The frustrated gamer is going to attempt to make a tree base. It's probably going to come out really badly. Okay, I'm going to make the stairs out of planks because I feel like I can make a ton of planks really fast. So let me take my oak logs. Let's put a couple in there. Let's make, I don't know, that should be enough planks. And I still have 33 logs left over. I don't really know how to do this, so I'm just going to kind of guess. So we're going to do that um, and then that. I'm gonna try to make, like, a spiral staircase here. Okay, I have officially made it to the top of the tree. Oh my gosh, I am really high off the ground. Um, okay, this is actually kind of terrifying, and there's, like, two branches, so you know what? We're gonna make the base right around here, and I'm gonna use, uh, I'm gonna use planks again, so let's just make a huge platform here. Again, if you guys have any more ideas for what you want me to do here, let me know in the comments. I'm just gonna make my best tree fort possible. But it's probably not going to be very good. Would you look at that? This is actually not that bad. And you know what? I have the fences anyway. And you know I'm going to fall off this treehouse and die eventually. So let me put the fences around the outside just so I don't fall. It's going to happen anyway. But maybe this will make it less likely. Okay, I ran out of fences. So I'm just going to have to be careful when I'm over here in the tree fort. <laughs> <laughs> this is the worst tree fort ever, but I'm actually liking this. So if I go back down, I just want to see what it looks like from the bottom. Oh my gosh. Okay. If anything, I need a fence around the staircase because that's really treacherous. Let's look up. Whoa, dude, that actually looks so cool. Okay. I'm going to make my crafting table, my furnace. I'm going to put a little, a little roof over it. This is actually turning out way better than I thought. Little Jimmy. What? Oh, I almost stood in the lava. What do you think about my tree fort? Little Jimmy. Okay, he's busy at work. I'm not gonna bother him. Oh my gosh, I have pigs roaming around my entire island. You know, get over here, Jiminy. Oh, he's four times, five times the pig. 
You know what? I'm just gonna let them roam around my island. I'm working on the tree fort anyway. So let's go up this treacherous staircase and try not to die. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make a crafting table and I'm basically gonna use this stuff as my fence. So let's put that there so I don't fall off. Then I think we have cobblestone. Let's make one furnace. Beautiful. Let's do that. And now everybody's gonna have to cover your eyes again because I'm gonna make a giant chest. So let's do one chest. We got two chests now, so YouTube's really not gonna be happy. Let's put it down there and there. Wait, there. Okay, beautiful. So that actually acts as like four blocks of a fence. Okay, I decided to fill it in with the fences so I don't die. Oh my gosh, that's all I have. Well, if I find a way to fall through that little crack in this tree fort, then I'm really dumb. I'm probably gonna be really dumb. But look at this. This is actually turning out great. So this seems kind of dangerous, but I am gonna need light during the nighttime. So I'm gonna put a torch there. I'm literally burning a torch on a tree. I, I feel like that's gonna set the tree on fire, which is then gonna set my entire tree house on fire. But I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit because I need light. And then let's put one right there. Okay, so now we have a little bit of light. I, I don't think that's gonna... That's, that's just a bad idea, but you know what? That's okay. Can I put glass over a fence? I, oh, I can. All right. So we're going to get just a little bit of protection in case anything comes flying into our tree fort, which I don't really know what would come flying into our tree fort, but you know what? Maybe little Jimmy is going to think he's overworked and he's going to try to kill me. Let's chop down these sugar canes because it's so fun. One more time. I'm going to scream very loud. So cover your ears. Ah, it's just so much fun. Oh. Skill increased. Herbalism. Okay, I'm a better, I'm a better herbalizer. I, I don't know what that means. Are my potatoes done growing? Come on, potatoes. I want to make more baked potatoes. Little Jimmy, how you doing, buddy? Can I upgrade yet? I probably can't, but you are busy at work. I'm going to sell all this stuff. I'm going to make a little bit more money, and then I'm going to go to sleep. Don't forget to hit that subscriber button and check out my vlog channel, TFG Vlogs. Like I say, new vlog every single week. I want to thank Skyforge once again for sponsoring this video. Check out the links in the description for that game, and I will see all of you in the next video. What if I destroy my real house and build a tree fort? Sam probably wouldn't be too happy.